I wanted to do a quick hair update. I'm five months post curly perm. This is next day hair. I've got two braids that I put in. Here you can see some of my major shedding, but now it's growing back. Right here, I lost a lot of hair here at the temples. But it does look like it is growing back. So the first thing I did was take these braids out and before I took them out, I put a little bit of oil on my hands just to help with friction and frizziness. And then I carefully took the braids out. This is just a speed up, a sped up time lapse of me doing it. On this side, you can see I slowed it down so you could actually see the detail of how I'm taking my braids out very, very slowly. And then I got my pick and kind of brought everything together in the back so that the part wasn't visible back there, but the part is still visible in the front. And this is just a classic braid out. It was super fun to wear, although my hair did get really frizzy by the end of the day, I still enjoyed wearing it, even if it meant ending up in a ponytail by the end of the day. tomorrow morning this is Friday this is Friday hair and I thought I would show you guys how I closed out the week wearing my hair and I'm gonna show you guys how I styled my hair it's very quick very easy very simple style but a lot of people at work liked it today so I thought let me just hop on here and film how I did my hair today so first thing I did was I split it in two and then I moisturized each section and um, brushed it out with my dimming brush my demon is it demon my demon brush which i'll link down below i love this thing i loved it when i had curly hair and i love it now because it really gets the roots and stuff so let me show you how i was doing this uh this is a crown braid but it's actually going to be a two strand so it's like a crown twist is what this is called so all you do is you split your hair in half right down the middle and then get something to hold the other hair out of the way. I'm just going to use a um, clip just to keep it out of the way like that. And then I'll show you what I'm doing to this side. It's a two strand twist. So what you want to do is pick up two pieces of hair and decide if you're going to go over or if you're going to go under. So I went over because I like the look of it. So that's what I'm going to do now. Two strands of hair. You take the first one, you go over the second piece, bring the second piece down, you go over again, and you kind of uh, detangle as you go. Not really detangle, but you just want to make sure it doesn't get tangly. So do this as close to your ear as you can. Grab all of the hair that you can grab so that it's nice and neat, and then twist all the way down. And then right close at the end, like this, is where I would close it off with a rubber band. Just like that. And I will be right back and do the other side. And through the magic of filming and editing, I am done with a two twist. All right, so then what I did was you take each one and you wrap it to the second one, like so. Then, once you get them positioned, you pin them down with some bobby pins. Let me show you the back. Oh, you see, I got a little bump there. So this is what happens when you just do your hair from the front all the time, you don't see the back side, what's going on. So just make adjustments as you go. Add bobby pins. 
where you need them and this is how it looks. So simple, so adorable. It looks kind of woven like a basket almost. Um, it's very loose. Like I said, it was, it, I did it very loosely. So it kind of just fell throughout the day, which I'm fine with. I'm fine with that look. So that's how I wore my hair today. I wanted to do a quick hair update. My roots have gone, grown out a ton, as you can see. This is about, this is all, this is like new growth right here, this portion. So this is how much my hair has grown out in the last five months. For the step one of the curly perm, it's a relaxer. What the, the perm does is it actually relaxes the curls out of your hair. So it relaxes whatever curl pattern God has given you. It takes that out and it makes your hair straight. And then the second part is where you get to pick your rollers and they put your rollers in, your stylist puts your rollers in and does the second part of the Wave Nouveau or the curly perm. And that's where you choose what size rollers you want and that's what size your curls come out as. Let me just show you what it looks like in the back. So that's what it looks like in the back. It's kind of growing in this V shape. And I did recently trim it, although I feel like I should probably go see a proper beautician who knows what they're doing. Because when I do my trimming, I mean, I just do like a dusting. Or if I see a problem, I'll take care of it like that, like a fairy knot. So I just went ahead and snipped it out. But this is how my hair is doing right now. Um, let me just update you on my shedding. I'm still shedding some. Um, I feel like it's better when, when I straighten it. When I wear it straight, usually when I wear my hair straight, I'll straighten it once in the week and then I won't put heat on it anymore. I'll just wear it in different styles throughout the week until either it rains or it starts smelling and it's time to deep condition again, which I did do a deep conditioning treatment before I straightened it. So I think it looks pretty good right now. Um, obviously you could, you saw the back of it now and this is how much hair I shed just right now as I've just been brushing it after taking my hair down. And also the crowns of my, the temples, excuse me, the temples of my hair are starting to grow back in. A lot of new growth there. Apparently I missed those sections when the hair was falling out. So thank God for that, because that would have made me even more nervous, I think, to see that. But all in all, my hair is doing fine. I feel like I'm in recovery. And I do plan on doing another protein treatment. My hairdresser advised me, she gave me some good advice. She said for me to just think of my hair as in like critical condition right now uh, and don't do anything to it. Just let it sit. She recommended that I do protein, a protein treatment and she recommended that I deep condition. Well, that's all I have for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the video for more content. And also, thank you so much to all of my new subscribers and thank you to the ones who have been here and who haven't um, just clicked off my channel or unsubscribed. Um, thank you so much for sticking with me. This has been a big dream of mine to do YouTube and to have this outlet. It was something that I started during the pandemic that I wish I had started sooner because it has been so much fun to do this and to film and to edit. That's just been the best. So thank you guys so much. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.